Nation with live breaking news. And that breaking news, it was a skateboarding ride called Wild in the Streets, and that's exactly how it turned out when skateboarders clashed with the LAPD in the Westlake District. Eyewitness News reporter Sh uh, Rudabe Shabazi is live at Lafayette Park where skateboarders ended up in handcuffs. To the skateboarders here, this was a celebration of their pastime in a good, clean way to celebrate and have fun for youth. But to the police surrounding them, it was potential trouble waiting to happen. Wild in the Hundreds of skateboarders descending on downtown Los Angeles, bringing an annual tradition celebrated around America to town for the first time. There's a couple thousand kids running up the street having a great time. But the good time blocked streets, congested traffic, and left some in handcuffs. There were some things that, uh, that they did that were not smart. Uh, we got more proactive in regards to actually citing them up for the violations because skateboarders, um, you know, unlike bicyclists, they do not have uh, rules of the road uh, obligations. And so it was really important to make sure that they adhered to the laws. About 60 officers and a police helicopter kept an eye on some of the skaters who were hanging onto cars and breaking traffic laws. Dozens of citations were issued, but there were no arrests made and no vandalism. My plan was just to go skate. <laughs> the cops are just following us. The point is to, it's our day, you know, to, to roam the streets and do what we want. Our freedom. The point of this is to go skate because we got nothing better to do. I see everyone right here. We all just unite. All to celebrate their favorite pastime and to declare one message. Skateboarding is not a crime. And the event was apparently to de benefit a nonprofit organization that provides skateboard, skateboards to kids who can't afford them. Reporting live at Lafayette Park, Rudabay Shabazi, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Rudabay. And we have